This is the bout of the tournament. Takakesho and Terno Fuji, the tournament leader on the left. He can win the championship by beating Terno Fuji right here. The last time they met was in September. Takakesho just smoked Terno Fuji by Oshidashi. Takakesho hoping to repeat the same type of sumo that he displayed in the last tournament against Terno Fuji. Terno Fuji, he must win here to force a playoff. Here we go. and keep Terno Fuji off his Mawashi. He fires, but Terno Fuji stays on his feet. Yes, sir. Now Terno Fuji gains an inside position and attacks. And Terno Fuji pancakes Takakesho. Now the two are tied with two losses each, so we are going to have a playoff. 13 wins and two losses, both men. Terno Fuji forces a playoff. With the victory over Takakesha. So Terno Fuji now six straight wins to finish off with a 15 regulation box. On this hit, Taoshi backward force down win for Terno Fuji. This man is looking very confident. So they go back to the Shitakubea dressing room, regroup and come back out one more time for the rematch. Now, the last match. Takakesho was able to keep the separation, almost takes the win, but the Terno Fuji amazingly regains his balance, gathers himself, pushes Takakesho back, they separate, Terno Fuji goes inside, now he's in very advantageous position, and that's all she wrote for Takakesho, pancake time. So Takakesho, a little bit of disappointment, but uh, he must forget about the loss he just suffered against Terno Fuji. All he needs to do is to deliver one more win, and he becomes the champion. But the same story goes for Terno Fuji. Winning two in a row over Takakesho will give Terno Fuji his third Makinouchi title. Takakesho, will he rise to the occasion? Terunofuji won the July championship, hoping to win his second championship in just three tournaments. Takakesho knocks Terunofuji back, Takakesho throws it over and takes Terunofuji to the edge and out! Takakesho wins the November tournament! Takakesho is the champion in the final tournament in 2020! Takakesho wins his first Yusho as an Ozeki. And also, Takakesho is the first Ozeki to win the top division championship since Kisaro Sato in the 2017 January tournament. Oshidashi victory. Makinouchi championship number two goes to Takakesho. What a sumo by Takakesho. A picture perfect. Solid tachi eye. Good hand placement. Bullseye to Tsupari. Terno Fuji unable to stop Takakesho's charge. Takakesho goes north and south, and there's nothing Terno Fuji can do about it. This man is the champ. Terno Fuji came close, but no cigar this time. Still, 13 wins and 2 losses finish. Achieving double-digit wins was the immediate goal I had when the tournament started. So I was able to achieve that. But I do regret having lost the playoff. What is your goal for next year? Returning to the Ozaki position where I used to be, that's all. Now Takakesho receives the Emperor's Cup for the second time. Takakesho also earns the winningest Rikishi of the Year honor. He won more bouts than anybody else in the top division, racking up 51 wins in 2020. Congratulations. Thank you. I had already lost in the regular bout. If I do my best, 
and still lose, that means I'm not good enough. And I just need to work harder and try again in the next tournament. The next tournament will be an important one for your promotion. If I'm strong, I will win. If I'm not, I will lose. I will reflect on myself and do my best. And that'll do it for day 15, the final day of the November tournament. Takakesho is the November tournament champion. And that's it for Ozumo in 2020. The next tournament is the New Year's tournament in January. It starts January 10th in Tokyo, where Takakesho will be gunning for Yokozuna. Sayonara!